Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Um, today I have a very unique unboxing to, to do. Uh, before I get to the unboxing, just uh, let me just tell you what it is. Uh, basically, these are shoe attachments, things that you put like on the bottom of your shoes. Um, and they have spikes on them so that you can walk around your lawn and aerate them. So uh, I personally have been a homeowner for several years now. And, you know, one of the main uh, you know, issues I've had is trying to keep the grass as nice as the last owner did. So they had professionals take care of it. But when I moved in, I really don't know anything about it. Um, so over the years, it kind of deteriorated. I've, I've even like started it from scratch again. And it's always a constant battle to keep it um, as nice as the neighbors who all have like professional uh, folks come and take care of it. Um, so anyways, one of the things that I've never done and I always thought about in the back of my mind doing um, is aerating my lawn. Um, however, you know, it does, there is a cost, there is time to it and everything to aerate it and I'm not even sure if it will work or not. But the typical price to aerate a lawn, um, according to homeadvisor.com, uh, it's been, uh, recently has been $175 per procedure. Um, so I've been looking forward to getting some aeration shoe attachments and lo and behold, um, I have a sponsor that was willing to send me one to, to try out. So that's what I'm gonna do today. Um, but before I get to that, let me just talk about some of the benefits of aerating your lawn. So, you know, over time, uh, you know, dead grass accumulates and it kind of builds a layer on top of your lawn and it's called thatch. And the problem with it is it gets so thick that it prevents water, air and nutrients from reaching down into the soil and to the roots of your grass. And, you know, this prevents, um, you know, long, deep roots for your grass to be healthy, but also it uh, leaves space for weeds to grow. So what aeration does is it, these spikes go into the grass and creates kind of a space around the grass. But, uh, you know, I mean, don't think of it as like huge holes, um, but these are tiny holes that are like 2.4 inches deep. Um, and then, you know, when it rains, the water can go in. Or if you water your grass, the, the water will, will get to the roots a lot easier and a lot faster. It'll loosen up any thatch that's there. Um, and if you do any kind of uh, nutrients for your grass, um, fertilizer or anything like that, um, it'll go in and, and absorb a lot better. Um, so with, with that, your grass will have, uh, you know, longer roots. And with thicker, longer roots uh, down in the soil, it kind of takes away space for um, any weed to grow as well, or at least reduce it. Um, so therefore you're promoting a healthier lawn. So with that said, um, I'm gonna go ahead and open this up for you and show you what it's like. And I'm gonna hopefully set it up today. It's kind of dark outside right now, it's late in the day, um, but uh, maybe tomorrow if it's not raining, um, I'll take it outside and demonstrate it for you. Um, let me go ahead and open this up for you first. So there's a company uh, and the sponsor for this video. It's called Padvik and these are called aerator shoes. Um, and it includes three shovels that no one else does apparently just for better and healthier environment, made in China. Um, here's like the SKU with, it's a 2019 upgraded version. Um, here's a listing of what's in the box. Of course, we're gonna unbox it and check it out anyways. Um, but you can see, you know, two aerator shoes, 26 stainless steel nails and nuts. So these are the actual spikes that are underneath the shoes. And let's go ahead and open this up. Obviously warning here, don't, don't let children and babies play with this. This is not a toy. All right. So there it is, it comes nicely packaged. So here are three tools right here to help you clean up any gunk that accumulates on the bottom of your shoes. All right. Let's take a look at these here. So they give you a wrench to, um, 
install these onto the shoe itself. So this is what it looks like. So you use this to attach the nut and the spikes onto the base of the shoes. And they've already done the research for you, but 2.4 inches is the ideal uh, depth to aerate your lawns with. And I think others um, may not be as long, but this company has already done the research for you. Here are the straps. Right there. And these, the straps are very heavy duty. Let me open one of these up for you. Can you hear that? Like nothing's tearing this apart. This thing is like rugged. Steel um, latches right here. And I really like how easy this is. Look, if you pinch it, you can see like the teeth that will bite into this to kind of hold it in place when you want to tighten it up. So that's a really nice touch. This is metal, not plastic. So this looks really, really sturdy actually. And there's a nice strong uh, closure to these when you let go. So it'll hold it in place. Definitely non-slip with these teeth. All right. And now we get to the base, okay? So this is like some special high quality plastic. The material is PP and HDPE. I'm not sure what that is, but it feels solid. <laughs> um, and you know, as long as you're not a child, this should be universal in terms of what types of shoes you can uh, fit this onto, like shoes and boots and all kinds of sizes because the only limitation is the heel right here. So that's fine. And then you can see there's already like cutouts for 13 spikes on each shoe. Okay. So just to give you an idea of uh, how this works. So you basically, can you see that? I'm going to put one of these in and you can see the top here is already like cut out so that it's, it's perfect and you can see it's nice and flush, right? And then you take one of these right here, these nuts, put it in and screw it on like that, okay? And they give you this handy tool for you to tighten it up. Right there, so it's nice and tight. That's not going anywhere, guys. So that's, that's, that'll give you an idea of how deep it'll go. So I'm going to go ahead and finish installing all of this. And then hopefully tomorrow, um, I'm going to try it out and I'll film it of course. And I'll show it to you guys. Um, this is not an instant thing. This is a long-term project. Once you aerate your lawn, you should see an improvement in the, in the, in the growth of your your grass as it develops uh, a stronger root system and you should start seeing less weed because the stronger root system is suffocating out uh, any possible weed growth um, and just your grass absorbing you know nutrients for those that are wondering uh, this this goes for 37.85 on Amazon these are Amazon's choice for aerator shoes um, so Amazon likes it too um, they already have four and a half stars and about 46 customer re reviews. Um, again, it's from Co Pedvik. So it was nice of them to send this along for me to try out and I look forward to testing it out tomorrow. Um, but I'm going to go ahead and follow the instructions here and attach the straps and install the rest of these <laughs> spikes right here. All right. So I'll see you soon, guys. Thank you. Just want to call out that there are six um straps that are the same length and they're for, you know three for each um shoe in the front and then there's two extra long ones um that go around your ankle to install the straps it's pretty easy um you pick a side to go down so if this was my left shoe i'm gonna go i'm gonna start from the top right here i'm just gonna put it in and out 
pull it, go down right here, and out. Like that. Okay, so that's how you put the strap on. And then what you want to do is take this, go down here, right behind the where you would you know press the clip and have it come back out like that and pull. Okay? Just like that. Um, one tip is you want to install the spikes first because look, there's a spike right under where one of these straps would go, f uh, well, well, where several of these straps would go, as you can see. So you definitely want to uh, install the spikes first. All right guys, so I finished walking around my yard and you can see that there is a bunch of dirt and uh, remnants of the grass and leaves stuck to the bottom of these shoes or these shoe attachments. How do you get them off? So as I mentioned, the company does give you three little miniature garden like tools for you to clean them off. So that's a nice touch. Let me take this wide one right here and just show you. It's like paste, it comes right off. You see that? You can see how clean it left it. All right, thanks for watching this video and let me know if you have any questions or comments. Please subscribe and give a thumbs up. I'll see you next time. Thanks.